Hey guys, what's up, Eric? I just want to go over a couple more questions that you guys had post Marshmallow update as well as some good luck stuff. So the first one's from Tony Sammons. He wanted to know how to get the lasso, which is where you take your S Pen and you can basically crop out or take a little screenshot of any portion of the screen. So let me just demonstrate for you guys. So what you got to do is press on the little button. Then you do smart select and you get the three features right at the top. You got the oval, you got the lasso, and then you got the rectangle. I personally use this a lot. I use the rectangle one myself, but he wanted to know about the lasso. So if you're missing this feature, go to my channel and watch the how to get back missing S Pen features. That's what I assume you don't have, which is why you can't see this. So with the lasso, as you guys can see, I was able to take a little screenshot of just a little portion of that laptop and then write on it if I need to and then I can just do save to gallery or share it if I need to and then let me show you once it saves that I can just go into my gallery app and right under screenshots it will be right there that's not it alright there so yeah so it's a great feature you know if you want to send something to someone Next question, how do I change the lock screen wallpaper? I can't with the good lock app. Honestly, I think it's the same exact way as it was before. I mean, it's working for me as you guys can see on the screen. So I just hold on the screen, lets me pick lock screen or home screen. Then I do set as wallpaper and then you'll see it'll be changed. So yeah, I mean, it's simple as that unless it's different for different variants of the phone. But yeah, for me, it was just as it is before. So as you guys can see, I am on good luck. Next question. I had a problem with this too when I first updated. So when you plug it into your computer and the USB and into your phone, it doesn't show up. So here's what I noticed when I had left my screen on. So once you plug it in, you got to be on your home screen. So you'll get a little message. See? To allow or deny. And with Marshmallow, you got to hit allow and then it'll automatically pop up on your screen that your Note 4 is connected to your computer and then from here you can change it to charging transfer just images so yeah I hope that helped you guys out the next thing someone wanted to know if I'm still getting monthly security updates and as you guys can see I am I uh, have been using this for the past couple of days it's actually been a lot better than the previous update I mean it says new enhancements and performance features which I have noticed mostly with my data connection it's been a lot faster so I assume this phone is probably going to be updated at least till September October even with the security updates unless Google said you have to continuously keep doing it so we'll see but yeah as of right now I am getting monthly security updates thank you guys for watching I'll see you guys next time all about that tech life take care bye bye